Hey, uh, what's up, guys? It's uh, Stu from Hangover. Hey, hi. How are you? You know, just uh, staring at my chicken. But that's boring. So let's do a little something something. Uh, 2018 Donner's Baseball. Half case. Number 12. eBay time. Come on. Uh, what time do I do tops? If you mean tops... Uh, Heritage Baseball, that is scheduled for 8 o'clock. By the way, guys, if you read the description of the listings, you will be able to find uh, not only the break time, uh, but m many other questions, uh, I mean, answers to questions you may or may not have. And plus, it's, it's, always, re it's always fun to read. The more you know. G.I. Joe. All right. Anyway. It's time for uh, time for action, my man. Abraham, I miss this guy. How are you? Good luck, everybody. Hello, mm, lovely. All right, let's go ahead and uh, do the good old, good old. I hear the Otani man came out to play last night. Quite a nice card. Quite a nice card. Let's see if we could uh, duplicate that. And bam. Right. And we're going to put this to the side. All right, you guys. Good luck. To everybody in the break. Let me uh, clean that up there a little. Let's do it. Oh man, these chairs are awesome. It's like my, I have to re I have to adjust myself now. I was starting to get used to the other chair. Now, I got to get used to this one. I'm not complaining at all. These are good adjustments. These are good adjustments. So, how's everybody's uh, weekend going Anybody do anything fun last night? I mean, it was St. Patty's Day. I wonder if there's a tool I could use that'll help me open these packs faster. That is not another human being. I mean, like a tool, like a, a I don't know if a knife, but like something. First box, and away we go. All right, we got Mookie Betts to 351 for the Red Sox. It's better right there for your boy. All right, this break is a long one, folks. To 199, Logan Morrison Rays.
These American Pride, we got a random. Seth Beer to 349. Can't believe that's that dude's like actual name. I don't even want to hear the word beer right now. That dude's actual name is Beer. It's kind of cool. I can only imagine the uh, possibilities of jokes. Alright, what do we got? We got a Joey Gallo. It's a 999 for the Rangers. Why is that? Ah, oh, Gallo. Isn't that homeboy's name? Uncle, my, my cousin Vinny? Isn't it his name Vincent Gallo? Like, I feel like I've heard that name somewhere before. Anyway. Got a random that. Three teams on that. What do we have here? To 349, Francisco Lindor, Indians. Got that there. To 999, Mr. Mike Trout, Angels. Whoa. Oh, these are, these are one of these dual autos. Oh, nice. That straight up goes to the Yankees. That's sick. Jorge Posada, 8 out of 15. And my man Gary Sanchez. That is sick. That's pretty sick. Donruss has like every now and then Donruss will have like really nice stuff. This is this is it right here. Do I've never seen well this is the second time I've seen this, but going to the same team we got Jorge Posada and Gary Sanchez. Auto on the front and on the back. That's pretty cool. All right, first box, very nice. Man, so this was a very nice case then. The Otani in the other half. I wonder I wonder what else came out. I didn't see the, the rest of the break. Uh, Jason did it last night. And I'm doing the other half right now. So let's see what else we got in there. Tyler Glass now for the Pirates with a napkin. Numbered two 120 Paul Goldschmidt D backs What do we have here? Gabriel Enoa of the Orioles with a patch. Got that there. On to box two. Box one technically had two autos. But it's going to one team, so let's call it one. And two patches. That's not bad, yeah. There's three hits per box. Either autos or uh, whatever. What up, back for MJ?
No, these packs are something else sometimes. Oh, back for MJ. Listen, dude. Uh, I could do that, but we'd be here for hours, dude. And I don't mean that literally. Now, I will let you know everything ships in this. And I'm pretty much focusing on the numbered cards, patches, and autographs, of course. But if I went really one by one, dude, like, so you're going to have me do, I show all the cards, so is this what you want me to do, man? Will that make you happy? So 49, Jacob DeGrom Mets, because, dude, I'm going to be here for a while. And that's just going to push back all the, all the other breaks. Gabriel, uh, I mean, Andrew Vaughn to 25 here, American Pride, that's pretty sweet, got a random that. Well, back for MJ. Uh, this is about as slow as I'm going to do this, my friend. But I will let you know that you can actually slow the speed down on YouTube. If you really uh, would like to see all your teams, if I keep this speed right here, it'll be reasonable time. Probably be done in like an hour and a half. But uh, you can definitely slow down watching it, bro. Giancarlo Stanton to 99 for the Marlins. What do we got here? Victor Robles with an autograph for the Nationals. That's pretty sweet. Back for MJ, like I said, man, you know, I have other stuff to do, dude. I'm not going to sit here and take hours to do one box. If you want to see every single card, man, you can slow the speed down. I, I love, dude, I love how, like, you you finally say something nice after, like, criticizing the entire thing. So, I see what you did there. Uh, anyway, Corey Kluber to 109 for the Indians. But like I said, man, you can slow the speed down while you're watching on YouTube. So you can actually see every single card. Because I'm not going to push back all of my breaks tonight just because one person wants to see every single card. No disrespect, dude, but we do have other people here in here, you know, that bought into breaks. Eric Gonzalez, Indians patch. Justin Verlander of the Tigers. That is numbered to 999. Sepias, uh, black and whites, all those variations. Everything gets sleeved. Rookies get sleeved. All that stuff gets sleeved. Dude, I'm not going to slow down back for MJ. I'm sorry, dude. As you can see, all these cards, are I got cards upside down. I got cards that are backwards. I'm not going to take two hours to do half a case, man. I got I got other breaks I need to get to, man. I'm trying to keep a, a schedule here. Dude, I love you. Thank you for buying into the breaks. But as you can see, you're the only one complaining about this. Everyone else really just wants to see the good stuff everything is going to ship believe you me if you bought i don't know how many teams you got my man but everything ships in this break and i do mean everything joey Votto to 349 for the reds Oh, 
on. Back for MJ. Listen, no problem, man. Like I said, this takes way too long. I will know. Obviously, you bought the Yankees. You're going to get all your Yankee cards. I don't know how many other teams you have, man. But you will get your cards. No problem. Of course you get your base cards back for MJ. Of course you do. Unless we state otherwise, you get all your cards, man. Which is why you're literally the only one that is complaining for base cards. So how do you know what you get? Like I've said, man, you can watch the stream at a lower speed. You can watch the break back in a slow like at a slower speed. If that is well listen, if you're if you're a girl, I could care less. You could be a dude, you could be a dudette. That's irrelevant to me, man. Or milady. But you could watch the video at a slower speed so you could actually see every single card if that's what you want to. But you see exactly. Thank you. I appreciate other people finally coming out like, oh, you got probably got somebody trolling you. So I'm not going to slow the breakdown just because one person wants to see every single card so if you wanna like never do business with us ever again just because of this that's kinda crazy uh... john smith you know how long it takes to break this don't you it takes about an hour dude so that means I'm already 20 minutes behind. I'm only on the third box. And it's already been 20 minutes. I got five other. Just for back for MJ. I am going to go ahead and go extremely slow. I'm going to literally show every card. Yeah, Chris Fitz. Now, let's see what happens. Uh, let me flip these. Yeah, it's eight boxes, man. If this was four boxes, I'd, I have no problem. Eight boxes is literally, yeah, I'm just, whatever, anyway. Uh, Gianluca Dallatri to 99. Oh, well, listen. We're going to go one by one, baby. No, she has a point. She wants to see every single base card. You are absolutely right. I am I am in the wrong. I can admit that. So we're going to go ahead and enjoy every single card that comes out of this Donruss half caser baby. Oh yeah. I wish I, I wish I could play some like Barry White or something in the background. That's what this feels like. Going going slow on the Donruss kind of feels like making some sweet loving. Mm. All these beautiful base cards. Oh, by the way, back for MJ, if you truly are a girl, uh just gonna give you fair warning the things get a little intense here sometimes and uh, we, we, we we do uh, get a little reckless with the things we talk about so you know just fair warning Shohei, Shohei Otani to uh, 999 for the Angels that's pretty nice 
would be even nicer if it was autographed. I'll I will try to go slower, Brandon. I'm sorry. I thought I, I thought I had the the speed at, at, at a decent rate, but you're absolutely correct. But there we. I'm sorry. Hold. Let me flip this for you so you can see what that is. Uh, oh, that's actually very nice. One out of ten, Yadier Molina. Not on card auto. That is a sticker. But that's nice. That is nice. What I do, long arms. Dude, John Smith, I have no idea, man. I, ha I haven't seen him play at all. But. You know, when I when I do ask people, they they seem to think that the hype is real on the Japanese Babe Roof. So I I need to see it for myself. You know what I mean? Sorry, uh, Dean Hub. I'm a, I'm gonna try to slow it down. Back for MJ. You going hard for the girl tag? Uh, I I'm sorry. I do deal with a plethora a plethora of juicy dongs. Which is why I refer to everybody as like a dude or a bro or so it's it's not anything negative, dude. My dudette is just it's just love. That's all. We're all dudes. You're a dude. I'm a dude. She's a dude. He's a dude. We're all dudes. You know what I mean, dude? Uh, to ninety nine, Aaron Judge, rookie of the year for the Yankees. Could be a troll. I'm not sure. And uh, I have no way of proving if it is or if it isn't, honestly. I wonder how long this is going to take. Got a random that. Got multiple teams on it. So Fitz, how are you? For the Phillies, Jake Thompson with a napkin. Max Scherzer to 249 for the Indians. Let me probably slow down. Uh, yeah, Fitz is in Dion Breakers. Well, Fitz, I mean, it's like you said. I, I, I don't want to lose any of them boys or girls. So, you know, I, I got I to gotta make the people happy. Even if that, that people is just the one person that wants to see every single car. She paid her hard-earned money. And honestly... I'm, you know, completely understanding. Even though I'd rather get my wisdom teeth removed right now. It's all good. Uh, do I do a recap? The answer for that, Dean, is I always do a recap at the end of the video. Fun fact. Orlando Arcia of the Brewers with a patch. Uh, what it do? Uh, who is? Oh, Sir Sir Charles Montgomery. Uh, he's he went back to his native land. Uh, I think he'll be back sometime this week, though. You know, I'll have him come pay a visit if you like. Whoa, that's kind of naughty language for a girl. Back for MJ. Oh man, I'm gonna tell your mom. To 281, Odubel Herrera of the Phillies. Is that is that what you tell your boyfriend back for MJ? Bust my ass. That was probably disrespectful. I apologize. Then again, that's just how we talk in here. So, but I still apologize. Eric Thames to 468 for the Brewers. Oh, dude. Do that. I love hollow notes. What can I say? I might be an asshole, but I do love hollow notes. Uh, I must be old 
Because I like Hollow Notes? Well, that's just like ageism or something. Although I kind of, I do kind of feel old right now with this fucking hangover. Uh, but no, I mean, I mean, I guess maybe I'm old. That's all a matter of uh, what's the word I'm looking for. That's all relative to you, or you know, to whomever. But I don't consider myself old. I'm 28. Uh, to 999, Justin Smoke, Blue Jays. We we were talking about chodes the other day. This is true. This is true. We we you know we talk about all types of stuff in here. Sometimes we talk about our favorite porn stars, positions, etc. And you know sometimes we talk about you know the existential crisis that is being the human being. It's boring even when it's fast fits. Really, huh? Funny enough, that's what my ex told me. <laughs> Yeah. Have Tomas and Pappy been on the stream yet? They have not. Long arms. I don't. I don't think so. They're probably like lurking, if anything, right now. It's not. It's not the. You know. I would say that's probably the main knock I have on it, Fitzy. But. There are there is some nice stuff, man. Like the rate of prospects, rookies, like when those are autos, they're sexy. Alright. Box three time. Letting the pot simmer. I'm I feel you back for MJ. But I mean my thing is this. It's just boring, straight up. Let me let me not even like sugarcoat it. It's just boring. Now I don't mind doing it, but you got to take into consideration that I also run a live stream. I'm trying to entertain people, and I had about well, close to like 20 people watching. That number's closer to like 10 now. Ever since I started doing, you know, the slowness here. So I'm just saying. Going slow at this point is kind of affecting my paper stacks right now. Because I could be doing a store break. Or I could be doing something else. You know what I mean? Oh, back for, back, for, back for MJ. What does that screen name stand for anyway? Like, Michael Jordan? You're back for Michael Jordan? Like, what? Oh God! Thank God I haven't I haven't seen score football in a minute. I will say this back for MJ, since I've since I've gone slow, I have hit some pretty nice stuff. So, in your infinite wisdom, you might be on to something, my lady. I, I know you're going hard for the for the chick tag. I'm, I'm trying hard to push that agenda. Tell me about it, Fitz. I'm not the biggest fan of baseball, which is probably what makes this difficult for me. Uh, but nah, man. If, if it was four boxes of this stuff, no problem. But a half case? Holy crap. Whoa, Brandon going hard in the paint right there. That's a serious accusation, my friend. Don't those people got to go like door to door whenever they move into like a new area? They're like, yo, I just want to let you know that like I like the Ditto Kids and I like I live next door now. I hope that's not a problem. That's pretty intense.
Plus, being a registered sex offender as a chick, is that really a thing? I don't think you can be a, a, a sex offender if you're a woman. I've never had I've never heard a man say, She raped me. Oh she took advantage of me. I don't think I ever heard that. Well, tell me about it, Fitz. I mean, you could voice your opinion if you head on over to, to YouTube. But, you know, it, it's it's passive-aggressive is probably a better option. It almost always is, but I just, I enjoy confrontation. What can I say? Oh, so who's calling old who now, uh, m'lady? I'm 28, and you're... Well, never never mind. It's not polite to ask a lady for her age. Uh, Shohei Otani to 349 with the Foundations insert. That's pretty nice. If I can think it, it's a thing somewhere. This is true. This is what I hear. Oh, Brandon, dude, I'm right there with you, dog. You're 30 years old. Pff, that ain't shit. Well, Fitz, I mean, it is. I, I gotta do what I gotta do, man. I gotta do what I gotta do, man. Would, could you believe it or not that this is actually helping me, like, deal with my um, hangover right now? This is kind of, it's kind of soothing to do this slowly right now, actually. So I gotta say, back for MJ. You might just be the love of my life right now, girl. Helping me with my with my guayaba right now. Guayabo, I mean. You're 46? Oh man, you could teach me some things. That's inappropriate. Uh ch 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 David He-Man. First things first, I don't even know your name, bro. I'm pretty sure your your name's not David He Man, so let's start there. Uh, and number two, I can send you some, but I'm not gonna send you all, cause that's just crazy. But I, I have no problem sending you like a dozen or something. No problem. Uh, send me a message on eBay or something, or what teams do you have in this break? That way I can know who you are and who to send it to. You know what I'm saying? Anyway. Giancarlo Stanton to 999 for the Mart Lins. Alright. You have 14 teams? Well, holy crap. You got like half this shit. Alright, so you're going to have me go through the garbage like a crazy person. No problem. Will do. Uh, again, I have no idea who you are. So if you could just send me a message on eBay or something, say like, hey, I'm that dude with 14 teams. Let me get all them damn rappers. It shall be done. Give or take a box, or, you know, a, a, a pack or three. Uh, does the Chrome card have a crease on the bottom middle? Uh, what Chrome card? You mean this one maybe? Yeah, that's definitely what it looks like on the, on the Stanton. Yep, it looks like it's lifted up a little bit there on the middle that kind of sucks uh, it's not actually not cool at all not cool at all or oh, uh, on the card anyway Oh, hold up. I'm going too fast. I'm sorry. Uh, show it. Well, another one with the, uh, like, bottom there crease a little bit. Show Otani to uh, 249 for the Angels. That kind of sucks. What's the rudest customer I've ever had? Oh, my God. Uh, okay, you mean since I've been a breaker or, like, in my life? Because I've had, I've, I've, I've had... My decent share of different jobs. Well, this is true, Fitz. I mean, you you hold the you hold the you hold the ring. You hold the power. Life is short. Trust the old lady. Oh, you know what? I do have a thing for older folk. 
like my grandma, R.I.P. And just like older people in general. So you know what? Back for MJ. I, ap I apologize. Because clearly you know something I don't. Rice Hoskins. Autograph for the... F okay, I shouldn't talk that loud right now. Rice Hoskins Phillies autograph. That's pretty sweet. Alright, back for MJ. Back, back, back for MJ. Love of my life. Uh... Sugar Mama. I'm going to call you... Sh is that is it alright if I call you Sugar Mama? Back for MJ? I hope you don't take offense to that. I'm going to call you that until you tell me not to. So, Sugar Mama. Uh, what's a good, like, remedy for a hangover? Lay it on me. I will, I will take any and all suggestions right now. What do we have here? Uh, to 487, Andrew McCutcheon, Pirates. What else we got? To 500, Cody Ballinger of the Dodgers. Yeah, I, I could have gone really in, I could have gone really bad with the nickname. But, you know, I figured Sugar Mama was a, a nice, nice little uh, name there. But, you know, old school, old school, you know. I don't even know how they, I don't even know how to, damn, that's like, how, I don't even know how to sweet talk, like, from an, I don't know, I'm just going to shut up. I I went through like I went through like a thousand different scenarios. None of them ended in my favor, so I just shut up. I have I have that uh, that beautiful ability of like before. Sometimes before I talk, I'm able to like go through a bunch of scenarios in my head. Like, hmm, if you say this, this will happen, or et cetera, et cetera. And more often than not, it's better to just shut the fuck up. Adalberto Mejia of the Twins with the badge. Oh, I could never ban Thor. Fitz, what do you I can never ban Thor. The Greek god? Never. Never ever. Uh Francis Martez to ninety nine for the Astros. That's kinda cool. All right, I'm not going to continue to call you back for MJ because I, I got to put a nickname on you. I got to. I just have to. It's a, it's a color, to, color to young man's thing. How about that? Uh, JBJ. See, just like he has a little nickname, JBJ, Jackie Bradley Jr. Kind of a lame nickname, but anyway, for the Red Sox right there. Uh, so I'm going to call you BMJ. Boom. Bada bing, bada boom. Dun dada. Just like that. It, it sure beats sweet tits. <laughs> Is that how they used to talk to chicks back in the day? Be like, hey, sweet tits. <laughs> when you're like catcalling them or whatever on the streets. Nowadays, it's like, what up, girl? I mean, it's really not like that, but kind of is. Like, hey, mellow yellow, girl in the yellow, what up, baby? Oh, fuck you then. You know, if they don't talk to you. That's kind of how it is. Like, hey, what's up, beautiful? Oh, man, you're so gorgeous. Oh, oh, that's how you feel? Well, fuck you, then. Oh, hold on. Going too fast. Oh, dude. The the entire breaking community would come down on me if I did if I ever did that, Fitz. Casey Mize, the 999 American Pride. It'd be, I'd be kind of like... I'd be like... Only thing I could put it to, it'd be like the equivalent of me, Brandon cooking to, to 99 somebody. You know what I mean? Oh, these are both, oh no, different teams. Oh, dude, Fitz, you, nah, man. People people stay calling for you on, on YouTube. Oh, where's Fitz? Oh, he's on Breakers? 
Aw, oh, man, tell him to come over to YouTube, man. The party's over at YouTube, man. Aw, oh, tell Fitz to get in here, man. Aw, oh, come on, Fitz. Aw. Aw. They literally typed that in the chat. Aw. So uh, you you got you got lots of you got a lot of pool you got lots of love in the breaking community fits. I don't know how many box I'm halfway through. It's been 41 minutes. Awesome. Oh, pff. BMJ, that ain't no thing. Uh. Well, no, that, yeah, you know what? You have a point. Being a server is probably, especially if, as a woman, I can only imagine. You know what? You guys got to deal with the cat calling and all that other stuff. I would love to get cat called, though. I would love to get cat called. Hey, you with the big dick. What's up? Who me? Ah, oh, no, nah, you you don't mean me. Oh, you don't drink. Ah, see, that was my first mistake. Unfortunately, me and my kind have been predisposed to be uh, alcoholics. And uh not saying that I'm an alcoholic, but I do enjoy my uh my my liquid courage. I just, I took it a little overboard last night. Because it, it's been a while. It's been a while since I uh, have let a little loose. I'll tell you what, I'm totally looking forward to rummaging through, rummaging through the trash for all these packs. That's going to be fun. That'll be the highlight of my night. Two large, ooh, and two aspirin before, but so you have dealt with your fair share of uh, of alcohol. Well, not alcoholics, but hangovers. Not you, but like you know of people. So okay, so two aspirin and glass of water before bed. And here I thought smoking a fat old blunt go before bed was a good idea. Oh, well, you know, I did that, though. I did have alcohol in the morning. Which is apparently good. And then I went, you know, and threw it up. You're c absolutely correct on that, BMJ. Unfortunately, I, I, I do like it the sauce. I like it the sauce. What's up, Tommy? How are you? B BMJ, by any chance, are you in any other breaks tonight? Just want to know. How uh, how are you, Tommy? Oh, man. Ooh, that would be nice. How long have you been collecting cards, BMJ? Is this like a recent thing for you, or did you did you get it from your dad? Like, like what's up? Like, tell me tell me the story here, as I uh, show each and every single card here for you. then okay got a Chris sale to 99 for the Red Sox ah oh so you've always been into collecting cards and stuff that's kind of cool I'll tell you what I uh, don't collect cards fun fact 
What have we got here? Andrew Benintendi. Patch for the Red Sox. Uh, to 270, Tyler Ma Maley, I think, or Male, whatever, however you pronounce it for the Reds. You know, all these cards be like backwards sometimes, so I got a flip. Is March Madness still going on right now? Are there games like happening right now? Benintendi to 353 for the Red Sox. Who's who's on right now? Oh, well, Barry LA, I can't play any music while I'm doing a break. Otherwise, I won't be able to upload the video. Otherwise, I'd be playing some Hall & Oates right now, my hangover music. Probably probably also going to listen to some Michael Jackson at some point tonight. E easy listening for your boy today. Maybe a little Earth, Wind & Fire. To 189, Harmon, Kilbrew, or the Twins. Tar Heels lost in the Spartans. Oh, damn. Sarah Smile. Who is that? I, I don't know who that be. To 999, Charlie Blackman Rockies. Yeah, BMJ, that is not fun. It's not fun. Oh, you mean the holler? Oh, I thought you was like, what? Sarah smiles. Like, is that like. Alex Bregman to 99 for the Astros. Dang it. BMJ, I'll tell you what, though. I probably would have kept that dollar. Yeah, being a, being a waiter, waitress is, is not fun. You're in the Bowman draft break. That is for 9 o'clock. But I can probably almost tell you that that's not going to start on time. I, ha I have this odd feeling. I don't know. It might start at 9.30, maybe 10 o'clock. But I'll do my best to have it start on time. Brandon, I mean... Yeah, I mean... Got gotta gotta please the lady. Jose Peraza to ninety nine for the Reds with a patch. I never I never did get into the bloody Marys. Tomato juice and alcohol just like should not mix. Ooh, I like that Barry. I like that a lot. Yeah, like mimosas, all that. Like, no, no. I, I, I don't like mixing. I'm not a fan of mixing alcohol with like chasers and stuff. I, honestly, John, I never got into it. Like as a kid, I was more into playing sports than like. I mean, I, st I was still like a nerd at some like, to some degree, because I would collect like comic book cards and stuff like that. Uh, Connor Pilkington to 349. I, I used to collect like comic book cards and you know stuff like that, but I never did get into like collecting sports cards. I don't know. I just I w 
I would rather just I would rather be on the card than collect the card. If that makes any sense to you. Like as a kid, that's what I did. You know, I just played a lot of sports. I was into a lot of different things. And I just I I just never got into it really. My favorite Hall and Oates song. That's a good question. I'll tell you what. It's not Sarah Smile, although that's a good song. I might go Man Eater though. I I might go Man Eater. Although there's something about that uh you make my dreams come true when it first starts off. It's just something about it just brightens up my day. Just brightens up my day. Oh, here she comes. Watch out, boy. She'll chew you up. Oh, oh, here she comes. She's a man eater. That's a great fucking song. I just wish I paid attention to him when I was a kid, like a kid growing up. Like, oh, here she comes. Like, oh, he's warning. Like, my dog, Hall and Oates were warning your boy back in the day. Watch out, boy. She will chew you up. No, I paid no attention. Uh, she's gone? Huh? Is that a song? I don't even know. Ooh, it looks like the case hit is there. It's from 1980. On, ooh, nice. Mickey Mantle. Whammy. That's the case hit. That's nice. That is nice. Badoosh. One of those per case. Going to the Yankees. Take this as zero disrespect, uh, BMJ. But are you a witch or something? You, you're kind of giving me Chris Fitz vibes right now. Like, you've been calling a lot of things eerily here. And it's starting to scare me. Joe Morgan to 500, the big red machine. Who he play for? For the Reds, that's who. You know, she wanted a mantle, got a mantle one of one, kind of. The case hit. Chris Fitz is a proven wizard, though. You are correct, Long Arms. You see this? You see what you see? What happens, Chris Fitz? I mention your name, and people come out the woodworks like, "Oh yeah, he's a wizard. That guy's a legend." I don't get that. Got a random that. Oh, here she comes. It's Donra's baseball. Bryce Harper to nine 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 for the Nationals. You know, Bell Biv DeVoe tried to try to warn me too. That girl is poison. Jet yo, by the way, uh Fitz, how do you feel about the Jets moving up to the number three spot, man? You guys going to pull the trigger on a quarterback or what? Uh, yeah, long arms. I'm, I'm surprised you didn't ask, man. You almost always do. Andrew McCutcheon of the Pirates. Uh, at some point tonight, we are going to get to uh, Heritage Baseball. Then Bowman Draft Jumbo Baseball. Spectra Football. Then we're going to do some Gridiron Kings Football. And then we're going to end the night with Court Kings Basketball. Why Gridiron Kings? Because Cardboard Jesus said so. Are you are you going to really question the Cardboard Jesus and his infinite wisdom? How dare you? How dare you? Uh, 
All right, only two boxes left. Tell me about it, long arms. Tell me about it. Uh, what's worse than breaking Donruss? Good question. Um, probably Donruss basketball. Does that count? Mm, I can't really. I don't know. Donruss is up there. I mean, don't get me wrong. There's really nice stuff in Donruss. Just takes forever. Yeah, Series 1 Baseball, not the greatest either. I'm not going to lie. That was not the best. Yeah, Series 1 was not the best. Well, somebody's got to break it so, so Bates can get the good stuff rah-rah. You know how that is, man. Yeah, was was that person a troll or what? Can I can I finally speed this up? Cause I, I literally slowed it down just for that person. I don't even know if it's a he or a she or what I'm just referring to it as it and that. I got I gotta vote to speed it up. what up, Kevin? Dude, did you see last night's episode? Oh my god! Goku! I need to watch that episode again like tonight. I saw that episode like a good three times last night. I was under the influence each time. But damn it, it was awesome. Alright, so I got a vote to speed it up. Well, rah rah! I would love to uh, skip the rest of the cards. Can't do that, but we can definitely shoot the shit about nonsense. We can definitely do that. All right, here we go. Yeah. Ah, I shouldn't get that loud. Uh, to three nine nine Al K line Tigers. Yo, Jiren, Jiren and Goku drew hands. Yo, they drew some nice hands. I was a little disappointed though that Goku didn't like finish things off in his Ultra Instinct form, but I mean, they got they had to throw some kind of twist in there, right? They couldn't just give you all the cookies, you know what I'm saying? Got a random that to 199, cold like Minnesota, Irvin Santana. I never thought I would make a little Yachty reference <laughs> in a stream. That's awesome. To 149, Mookie Betts, Red Sox. I'll tell you what. I definitely did not see uh, what's his name, Android 17, like being still alive. That was like what? Francisco Mejia of the Indians. Autograph. Like, I knew Frieza was still alive. But Android 17, like, even Zeno was like, yo, he's gone. And deleted him from the board. So is he gone for reals? Like, I really thought, I, th I really thought he was dead. I thought he sacrificed himself. Is there any superhero that could beat Goku? Um, if I had to say, it, honestly, I'm not into the comics as much as I used to. But there's a few comic book, like comic book people that could do it. Like some of their powers are just ridiculous. 
to 99, Aaron Judge, Yankees. Like, Superman could probably beat Goku. Because it's Superman. Gotta random that. Well, Kevin, I'll be here, bro. I'll be here. Mac Williamson Giants Patch. All right. Well, what is this? Joey Gallo Rangers. Manny Machado Gold. That means it's to ninety nine for the Orioles. I can't wait till this turns into four box breaks. My sorters especially. This stuff takes forever. Could have been done like half an hour ago. Nah. I'm lying. I probably would have been like just getting done. Jake Lamb to 99 D-backs. Brandon, are you into like anime or like comics or anything like that? To 349 Max Scherzer Nationals. I know we're just shooting the shit here, but you know, gotta ask. Got a random that. Yeah, we're all raw. Well, we gotta do what we gotta do, man. Cause like we discussed many moons ago, getting this stuff out in a nice, uh, nice prompt time is indeed a factor and doing half cases just do not help with that Ooh, rah rah now we're talking but you know that might not be best rah rah for the monies if I'm just keeping it 100,000 million percent with you Do you watch any of the like any of the the comic book shows? Because the the Flash actually does have, um, like his own TV show or whatever. It's not bad. I stopped watching though, like after the third season, just because I don't really watch TV like that anymore. But the TV show is pretty dope. By the way, those of you that are tuned in to watch the Heritage Break, it's going to take place right after this. Um, give me roughly another 10 minutes and I'll be done with this break. Appreciate you and your infinite patience. Gotcha, Brandon. I mean, it's not for everybody. The new Black Panther movie is pretty sick, though. Avengers coming out pretty soon.
Second to last box. Two out of five. Anthony Rendon of the Nationals. That's pretty sweet. I seen this pretty good movie on Netflix. Uh, of course, Barry L.A. Who hasn't seen that movie? That's only like one of the greatest films ever. You mean De Niro? <laughs> Dude, they got everybody in that movie, man. Pesci, De Niro... I think Pacino's in that thing too. No, no, he's not. I lied. I met Rosario of the Mets. Actually, I've never seen Taxi Driver, actually. That one I have not seen. But I hear it's really good. There you go, Mets with a hit. I, you know what I saw actually recently? Well, I was going to mention another movie. It's on Netflix. It's called The Foreigner, which is pretty cool. You should check it out. Um, I seen Casino recently on Netflix, and that movie is like a three-hour long. Another epic from the genius Mr. Martin Scorsese. That's another great fucker. They don't make why don't, why don't they make like gangster movies anymore, man? Gangster movies are like the shit. Oh, I know why. Because uh, it would hinder the, the, the progress of the pussification of America. Which has been underway now for a few years. John Lamb of the Angels of the Patch. Max Scherzer. 249 Nationals. Charlie Blackman to 359 Rockies. To 999 Chris Sale. Red Sox. You know, I've never seen any of the Godfather movies either. Mainly because there's too, they're too long. Although I did watch Casino, which is three hours. But I don't know. I, Casino, I don't know. I felt like the Godfather was too... I think I did try to watch the Godfather at one point when I was a child or something. And it was just way too slow for me. So I was like, well, fuck this. At least with Casino, the very first scene, they try to kill Homeboy. You know, they, they try to kill De Niro, or whatever his character's name was. Sam, whatever, the Rothstein, I think it was the Sam Rothstein. It's a 199, Corey Kluber, Indians. That's like the very first scene. He gets in his car, and the shit blows the fuck up. Like, goddamn, how am I, how am I gonna not watch this movie? You know what I mean? I don't really recall how The Godfather starts off, but I can tell you, I probably fell asleep. 230 Luis Severino Yankees. Maybe I should try to watch it now because I'm an adult. Quote unquote. But who has three hours to watch him? Well, I had three hours yesterday because it was my day off. But who has three hours to watch a movie? Shohei Otani to 999 Angels. Watch it now that I'm older. Yeah, I might I might enjoy it. I might not. I don't know. I kind of like being able to say that, though. Because anytime anybody asks me, like... Because I enjoy movies. I do. I enjoy movies. I don't know if I'd call it a hobby, but you know, I do enjoy watching movies. So anytime we're talk like, I'm talking about movies with anybody, and then they mention, Oh, dude, have you seen The Godfather or whatever? And I'm always like, no. And then they're always like, what? And I'm always like, yeah. Because I just like to be different. Yo, Mancada of uh, the White Sox. That's number two, three, three, one. Uh, 
Actually, Ra Ra, I do not. One hour throughout the day total tops. Where you know, I'm pretty efficient with 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 mine. I would say within within a twenty four hour span, about one hour of that is dedicated strictly to XNX, X and Red Tube and whatnot. What's it gonna be called, John Smith? I might need to watch that. Cause gangster movies, like the last and I don't even know if I would call this one a gangster movie, but like the most recent gangster movie I think I've seen would probably be The Town with like, who's who's in The Town? Ben Affleck I think is in The Town. Oh wait, there's another gangster movie I've seen too. Uh, it's the one with... with uh, I was going to say Hugh Jackman, but that's completely wrong. Uh, damn it. What's his name? The guy from The Shining? Or whatever that movie's called? He played the Joker in a Batman movie back in the day. What's his name? Uh, Jack Nicholson. Jack Nicholson. There it is. Took me a while. I, I had to, like, reboot the computer. You know what? Truth be told, Barry, I've never seen a single Clint movie ever. Yeah, so Jack Nicholson is in it. Leonardo DiCaprio's in it. And it's definitely not The Irishman. I, although I haven't seen that one. No Country for... Well, no, that's a different movie. Anyway, it's, it's the one with There's uh, Jack Nicholson's in it. Leonardo DiCaprio's in it. The Departed. There it is. That's a great fucking movie. I don't know if Scorsese directed that shit. Well, I would not be surprised if he did. Because that's a great fucking movie. That I would say that's probably like the most updated gangster movie I've seen. Ah, so Scorsese did direct the Departed. See, I knew it. I should know. I, I should have guessed because it it's a great fucking movie, and I don't think I've ever seen a, a terrible Scorsese movie. I've seen the Departed at least twice, and it's it's great every time. I, I gotta check out the Irishman. Hopefully it's on, on Netflix or something. Mark Wahlberg, Alex Baldwin. Who's in that? Ah, it hasn't come out yet. Got it. Oh, so that's the new movie that they were that my boy was talking about. Is Joe Pesci still alive? If so, he needs to be in it. If Joe Pesci's not in it, it's not a true gangster movie. So therefore, The Departed, I don't think counts. I don't think Pesci was in The Departed. Mark Wahlberg was in The Departed? Yeah, he was. He was like the ass... He was like the asshole... Like, copper or whatever. That was going at it with Leo... I saw 300 too this weekend or on Friday. Another badass movie. IA Internal Affairs. Yeah, I gotta watch that movie again. I just, oh, he's a copper, boom, copper. I just limp, I just lump them all together. It helps me enjoy the movie better. Oh, like, he's like a copper's copper. He's like the copper for the coppers. Ah, see, that makes complete sense. Because Pesci... 
I think is Italian. So that makes a whole lot of sense. Hmm. Should have been put those together, Raw Rock. Good fucking call. That's why I keep you around. And now it's time for the last box. I never thought we'd get here. Uh, to 250, Gary Sanchez of the Yankees. Oh, I ain't got no got. Oh, no, it's 350. 350. I ain't got no goddamn 350, woman. Uh, Sean Weimer to 349, almost 350. American Pride. Pesci's still alive, right? That would suck if my dude passed away and I didn't know about it. Steven Strasburg, Nationals. I mean, that, that time will do that to you, Barry. Time will do that to you. Time is undefeated. Shohei Otani to 999 for the Angels. Man, a bunch of Otani uh, inserts and whatnot in this case. The auto came out of the other half. There could still be an auto lurking in this one. Let's see. That would be sick. Two Otani autos in one case. That would be awesome. This is still pretty sweet. Rafael Davers of the Red Sox with an auto. Uh, what is this? Benintendi patch for the Red Sox. I think Kirk Cousins and the Vikings are about the same place they were without Kirk Cousins. I don't think he's going to make them any better, but I don't think he's going to make them any worse. You know what I mean? I don't know. We'll see. Hopefully they can uh, recuperate from that collapse they had. That shellacking the Eagles put on them. Chet Pinder of the A's with a patch. I guess they could have that like as a chip on the shoulder. Like, oh, we lost to the to the champs. So, hmm. The KB blank back. That goes to the Cubs. Short print. Justin Verlander to 249 for the Astros. What did he get paid again? I don't even know. I know I'm pretty sure he, 29 million a year. Fuck. That's a lot of money. That is a lot of money. You better put him over the hump for 29 mil a year. Shit. Sadly, I don't think he is though. Got that there. I'm probably just salty because he, you know, he didn't even consider going to the Dolphins. Like, we weren't even on the short list to get him. Miguel Cabrera for the Tigers to 500. Hopefully we draft my boy. Everybody shit on him right now, but I really think he's going to be a stud. My boy Baker Mayfield. Last tag mojo here. Justin Smoke to 999 Blue Jays. 84 million guaranteed, man. Must be nice. Must be nice. To 25, Andrew McCutcheon of the Pirates. Bears fan. Oh, well, yeah, you ain't. T tell me about it, Ra Ra. Tell me about it. Alright, that was a break. All right, we do got a little random to do, though. So we're going to do that. The random is this. I got two teams. A team on the top and a team on the bottom. Now, some of these have three. 
So this is how we're going to do things. See, I got three here. And these are all two. What up, Michael Ray? So this is how we're going to do things. I'm going to roll die. If I get an odd number, it goes to the top team. If I get an even number, bottom team. Odd top, even bottom. Here we go. The number two. That is even. So it's going to go to the bottom team. So this one goes to the Cubs or whoever Ryan Sandberg is. I don't know. I'm not sure if that's a Cub or a White Sox. Uh, we use the checklist for that. We got Reds, Royals, uh, again, Cubs or White Sox. I believe think it's Cubs. Cardinals, Orioles, Royals, Reds, Cardinals, Orioles, Cubs, Royals, Cubs. Right. Now for these, we're going to roll a different kind of die. This one, six-sided. So if I get the number one or the number two, it's going to go to the top team. Numbers three and four, middle. Numbers five and six, the Indians there last. So here we go. The number four. Going to go to Cardinals. There it is. And uh, we're actually not done. We rolled the number four, so let's go four times in the randomizer. We actually do have to do a little random here. So let me pull them up. The random is here. Put that on the screen. All right, so for this randomizer, it's for the USA cards. We're going to go ahead and random every single team, as you can see there. I'm going to go four times in the random for the USA cards. Top team wins. Good luck. And the money shot four. Going to the Orioles. So the USA cards go to the Orioles. And these are the USA cards. Right here. Andrew Bonta 25. That's some nice stuff there for the USA spot. And now the recap. Remember. All right, Brandon, have a good one, man. Thanks for hanging out. Only recap the autographs because that's all we care about. And it was pretty decent, pretty decent. So here we have, here the not an auto, but it is the case hit. Mickey Mantle, Yankees, Whammy. Davers, Red Sox. Rosario, Mets. Mejia, Indians. Bregman to 99, Astros. Hoskins, Phillies. Molina, Cardinals to 10. Robles, Nationals. And Jorge Posada. And Gary Sanchez, dual auto to 15 for the Yankees. Sick AF. And that was a break. Pretty nice. And that was 2018 Donruss Baseball Half Case number 12. eBay Stiz out. Thank you very much. I'll get that out to you.